Welcome back, you guys! This is the Syndra, continuing my Hoi 4 Kaiser campaign as the Republic of Thailand. And it looks like the Germans are gonna do our job for us by conquering Russia. Well, also Japan's job, because Japan apparently is just completely incompetent. I'm still building a lot of infrastructure, and I think I'll stick with that for a while. I wanted to get everything up to 5. It's like a bare minimum, five everywhere. It's taking a while to do, but it's fine. Oh, there was a hot fix. Uh, there was like, oh, what is this? There was a, a Christmas hot fix or whatever, like 0 0.83. And now they're doing it again. Okay, so they've changed some things. I thought it was just like a Christmas thing, but no. Apparently, there's a big fucking wasteland in the middle of uh, Tibet now. Okay. That's interesting. I did not know that was going to be there. There are more wastelands. There are wastelands all over. What is that going to do? What is this? Is my saved fucked? What did you do to me? Why would you do a Christmas patch that ruins my save? You bastards. You absolute fucking bastards. God damn it. God damn it. Alright. Well, it's not ruined. It's not ruined. They just fucked up my part of popularity. That's not the end of the world. It's not like we need that to be high. We already have most of the political power we need. Ah, but it's still it's still annoying. So yeah, I was doing the air core right now. Air bases, interception detection, making all of our fighters cheaper. I don't think I need this. This is 91 days for some reason. So is this. Did they finish this thing here? No. They didn't finish this. All right. God damn it. Yeah, let's do the navy then. That's fine. Ah, I love when they do patches like this. Don't you? Just random patches. The Christmas patch that just ruined... Could have ruined my save. And I keep having to adjust this. I need so much steel. Low echelon support. Fighter detection. So who is fighting again? I'm hoping they did some optimization as well, because that would help out so much. Serbian Panama War? Panama War. What? Hmm. The Entente is fighting the uh, the Austrians here. Oh, they're actually invading into the Austrian Empire. Intriguing. Very, very intriguing. How are the Germans holding up in their push? No, fuck off. So I think they had to restructure. They like to do this. Every time I load up again, they like sort of fall back and then redeploy, which is weird. Let's do uh, excavation. I'm hoping I don't need this much steel, but no. What is happening? Why am I getting booted out of these trade deals? What? Give me my steel, you bastards. Oh, I don't have enough factories right now. Alright, I'll scale this down. And I'll trade for a single sheet of aluminum. Thank you. Okay. Germany, how is the push coming along? Are they gonna try to take back Moscow? Hope not. I hope not. Okay. Anything else change while I was uh, gone here? Does not look that way. Just go ahead and push you guys out so you are at full strength. Okay. 
You're horribly green, but that's fine. I think I'll take the opportunity to just drill you, maybe? Yeah, this support equipment number is still completely fucked. No. I'm not signing a non-aggression pact. Ooh. The French Republic had their uh, revolution, or the natives have uh, risen up against them. Yeah. That's not gonna last. That's not really gonna last. And neither are the Austrians, apparently. Really? Okay. Okay. But there's also going to be a war between the Reichspakt and the Entente. And judging by the fact that the Entente is getting ridiculously strong, my money's on the Entente. Okay, we don't need anything over here. Um, it is 1943. Um, I'm thinking... Do we go for this? No, we don't have any boosts to this. Let's unlock some tanks for fun then. Just take advantage of our boosts. This, this has to stop, okay? Honestly. What if I just stop trading all... Just, let, I'm gonna stop trading with you guys. You guys are so unreliable. I'm gonna spend a lot of my convoys trading with the British. How about that? Most of my convoys are now just going to the British. Am I making any convoys? No. What if I do this and just add a single one? Do I need to change? Yeah, then I can scale it down. That's good. Alright, alright, this is working fine. We have 15 factories for guns, and apparently that is enough for our steel to be completely... Um, we're very, very dependent on that. So I can actually do some of these things here to... Uh, hmm... Popularity... Party popularity goes up by 5. No, that's not worth it. It's not worth it. I'd rather just grab this when I can. Hmm. The Navy is done. Marine technology, we don't need that. Let's go ahead and grab this. Get some more dockyards. That'll be good. Dispersed fighting. Do I have any boosts? Refinery, oh yeah, I suppose we could do that. We don't need rubber, we could go oil. Mm. You guys have your orders, I'm gonna put you on aggressive as well. You guys are not as optimistic about your push. Oh, they're fortified. I think that's fine. We can just have them attack into us, ruining their fortifications. Mm hmm. Yep, not touching any of that. So, Germany. How's the push coming along? It seems the Russians are back to a million manpower reserves. That's just, that's, that's just Russia in a nutshell. And it looks like Austria is going to fall. Once Vienna falls, they usually fall as well. They can't really hold out. Not really. Hmm. Do, is Hungary a major power? Let's see here. Uh, is it this one? Let's see here. No, Hungary is not. So once Austria falls, the whole faction crumbles. <laughs> so once Vienna falls, like this battle here resolves, I think uh, the entire faction will just die. Yeah. Isn't that sad? 
And then there is nothing else going on here. Yeah. That is amazing. So two Sicilies and Rome are also fighting against them. So maybe they'll take Italy, but um, yeah, this is not good. This is not good. Oil processing is continuing here. I'm just taking advantage of the boosts I have. They're like 18 days, which is very, very quick. And my manpower keeps rising. Do I have enough to go 40 wide divisions? Hang on, hang on. If I split you... If I do this... We've got infantry. We've got this. Let's go ahead and change all of this. Hmm. No, 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 wait. I'm gonna do another field marshal here. And then I'll put you in charge again. How's this? Now come on, why is it not painting? Ah, it's fine. Put you on aggressive. And then you, I'll put you on aggressive as well. Yeah, no, 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 don't go into the ocean. That's bad, you can't breathe there. Hmm. Light tank is done. I don't have any more boosts to that. Do I have any boosts anywhere? Okay, I got some doctrines here. I think trade interdiction is by far the best option for us. You just lost your field marshal? That's not what I wanted. Why is this so difficult? Cancel this. Look. Look. I have two dudes, okay? You are my just gruntman, okay? And then I have some cav backing you up. Okay. That's all I want. It's double field marshal orders. That's it. It's not complicated. It shouldn't be complicated. And then I'm thinking... Ooh. We can now go to war with Deutsch Ostasien. How For how long do I have this? There's no timer on this. Really? All right, that's good. Nope, decline. Uh, Chief of Navy, Chief of Air Force. I don't know. Battlefield support. Just give me air superiority. This one. Yeah. I'll take that. Your orders are to take everything along the coast here. And you guys as well. Yeah. Just set up and then push when I tell you to. Um, yeah, Germany is taking its sweet time. Russia is down to 57%. Alright. Alright. 5 million casualties. They're pushing up into Finland, it seems. All right, all right, all right. Yeah, they got plenty of manpower reserves. This is not going to be an issue. It's just taking a while. I should have read, like, the patch notes for this. Because, yeah, they, apparently they added, like, a dead zone inside of Tibet. I don't know what's going to happen with, like, the Yunnan clique. Oh, no, the Ma clique. And Mongolia. But, all right, that's fine. What else did they change? Persia is a part of the Dono Adriabund. Okay. Vienna has still not fallen. Once it falls, I mean, just finish it, would you? It looks like they're losing control of this. How? 
They have like... Yeah, okay, they have some troops. But you're the Entente. You are way bigger than they are. And Britain is still not fallen. Huh. Advanced oil processing. Oh, I can go all the way down to the bottom. Really? That's a lot of oil. I don't need to import any of it. Just, there we go. Just. All right. We have some leftover oil then. That's that's good for the future at least. Uh, how are you guys looking here? Inferior enemy, but they're fortified. How have they had time to fortify everything? It must have been a focus, right? Mm. Yeah, this one. You sort of notice the uh, the icons for uh, for the uh, the focus trees. Night vision is up. Good. What else are we doing right now? I think we got no more boosts to uh, stuff there. Let's see. Non-aggression pact. Decline all three of these. And then give me support equipment. Uh, ACR bonus one. I think one of those is... Um... Actually, I have no idea what that is. But it's fine. It's fine. Let's start doing some atomic research. It's going to take a while, a whole year, if in fact. So, if I were to change you and make you 40 wide, how would that impact if I do artillery as well? Hmm. So artillery, we have enough. I'm going to save this. So how much would a force attack cost us? Hmm. I think that's not updated yet. Okay, logistics are here. Um, do we want anything else here? I don't think so. It is basically 1944, so I'm going to go for this. The Bay of Bengal. There's a fight going on there? Really? I'm only at war with Russia. How is there a fight there? Oh, you're pushing quite far east. You've taken Kazan and Nizhny Novgorod. Russia is at 65% capitulation. Stop sending me these. I'm not interested. Modern oil processing. All right. So, we've got some decent oil now. We've got 12 to spare. That's not very, very good, but it's something at least. I think I'll get the radio as well. A radio detection, that is. I have the radio itself. Thing is, if I declare this war, there's nothing holding back these dudes. Yeah. Hmm. Can I hold back this thing with the units that I have? I kind of doubt it. I kind of doubt it. Um, ideally, I would like to just crush Malaysia and then move on to this. Um, hmm. Can you push to Kuala Lumpur and you guys push to here hmm all right it's gonna be awkward but my divisions are now 40 wide 
Well, once they fully reinforce, it's apparently they're just missing the manpower. A lot of manpower. I want to say like 300,000. When are you guys going to get your reinforcement tick? Vienna has fallen. Oh my god. Austrian Empire has capitulated. And that is the end of the faction. Incoming massive lag, I imagine. Not lag, it's just FPS drop. And wait, there's a dead zone over here in Belarus. Yeah, my game is uh, crapping up right now. Hmm. Hmm. Look, I'm looking at Belarus. What is that dead tile in the right in the middle of it? Is that like Chernobyl or something? <laughs> no, that can't be there. Commonwealth of Canada. What is this? They added this and now it's a dead one. Uh, I hate when they do these patches and ruin my saves. I really hate that. So now they're going to slowly but surely create some puppets over here. I imagine. So Rome took a piece of Italy and so did Sardinia. Uh, let's see here. Destroyer models. Cruiser models. No, give me destroyers. Yeah, the game is uh, lagging a bit. What is this piece? Ooh. The Hellenic Socialist Republic is piecing out with uh, a bunch of people. Thank you. Go away. We've got an extra dockyard, but I'm just going to put it into the convoy. Yeah, the game, the game. Thank you. You're just making puppets. Why is that so difficult? I will never understand that. Sardinia is taking the coastline here in Croatia. Alright, alright, alright. I just want these nations to die. I hate the puppet creation in Kaiserreich. I really, really hate it. Look at this. Look at this mess you've made here. They're all weaklings. You can't use any of them. And you're still creating puppets? Uh, Galicia Lorimeria. I don't know what the, what's left there, but... I'm hoping that once all these puppets are created, the game is going to run way smoother. So the only thing left is Britain. Britain is on its own there. And then there's this war against the French Republic. It seems like these dudes have joined with... No, not these dudes have joined with the British? No, they're not in a faction together. They're just fighting against the French Republic. Okay. Okay, that's that's fine. So the Entente is now very massive, but remember, all of this here is just dead. It's nothing. There's no... Like, the units, zero. Zero, zero, one. Zero, two. In this entire region, there's probably like five divisions. That's, that's that's the thing I hate about the puppets. They're useless. Unless they have a fuckload of manpower and you can just make... Use them as like a manpower sponge. They're useless. They're absolutely useless. And I hate it. I hate it so much. They're doing a treaty with Hawaii? Okay. I don't know why though, but... And there's a dead tile over here as well. Man, I don't want to have to restart. I was doing so well. Ish, kinda. Ah. So, Deutsch Ostasien, what do you have? You've got like 60 something ish troops, very low manpower reserves, but you've got a fleet of 130 ships. That's something at least. Okay, let's go ahead and get some ships unlocked, shall we? Okay, excavation, we can drop one of you. Do we have any steel in these provinces that are up for grabs in this peace deal? Yes, no, maybe? 
Well, the game is running smooth-ish. This is speed 5. It doesn't feel that way. Strike at the Panama Canal? Are you going to war with the Entente? Where's this? Gains annex war goal against the Commonwealth of Canada. Germany, finish off the Russians, please. I mean, you are pretty big, but I don't think you can handle the Entente and the Russian. Don't do the Hitler thing. Don't do wars on two fronts. <laughs> don't go full Hitler, man. Wilhelm III. You don't fight the East and the West at the same time. God damn it. Uh, Spain. Yeah, I don't care. They were sending us some supplies, but it's okay. So I think all of my dudes are mostly fit. They've been reinforced, so they're 40 wide and they're massive. I hope. You guys are still 20 wide. I just have some calf because they're fast. That's about it. Uh-huh. Okay. What did you what did I put on you? Only shovels. How can I see my like stockpile of actual stockpile of support equipment? I have no idea. If I if I do this and I give you logistics, I have no idea. If I just give you field hospitals and this, what is it going to say here? Uh, apparently we have everything we needed for that. Amazingly. I don't know. It feels buggy. It feels really, really buggy. Do you guys have the support equipment? It should be on the way. Having field hospitals is quite decent if I'm gonna try to save up my experience and well yeah experience and the manpower okay where's the capital of Russia right now is it in uh, Vladivostok you've actually lost Vladivostok Japan why do I need to hold your hand okay why do I have to hold your hand Ah. Hmm. Seeing uh, if the capital is in Vladivostok, isn't into all of Russia just drowning? I'm sinking all of the uh, the convoys here. So if the supplies have to go from here, all the way through down here into the Mediterranean and up to, like, here? I think that's the only dock they have access to. Yeah, there's like three of them up here. Isn't, like, all of Russia starving, then? Holy shit! They should be starving. Yes, they are. Low supply. You're attacking. Low supply. All of Russia is drowning! Oh my god, that is amazing. The capital got swapped to Vladivostok. <laughs> luck. More and more luck gets added to this campaign every single time I play it. It's ridiculous. Alright. Well, I don't think Japan can fuck up an enemy that cannot resupply its organization. Maybe I shouldn't jinx myself <laughs> with that. But let's assume that they cannot fuck it up. Ireland, Morocco, yeah, I don't care. Just, just give me support equipment as much as you can, guys. And it seems all of these pushes are failing. Yeah, good. Very, very good. It seems the guy I have assigned to Malaysia here is very, very confident that he can take them on. That's good. You are not as uh, confident. Alright. You're kind of stretched thin. Hmm... Do I let them expand north? Hmm. 
I don't know if I like that idea. Well, we can slow their advance, and if we just be aggressive about it, maybe we can crush them? Maybe? And maybe we can get some backup from uh, Japan. But we also have the AOG, which is going to join in. I got some uh, destroyers. Give me uh, submarine models, please. Germany, just, just kill Russia for me, would you? They should not be able to oppose you anymore. They have no supply. Unless we take Vladivostok. Which is very, very likely. If we take Vladivostok, which we did, they're down to 85%. 85! Come on, guys. Where's the capital of uh, Russia right now? It's in Bukhara. It's in Bukhara. Alright. Ah, I don't know, guys. I don't know. We're just waiting on stuff to happen here. I want to declare war. <laughs> I want to declare my war. Ah, infantry equipment 3 is done. Um, what? What do we do now? Let's, um, maintenance company. Anti-tank, I suppose. We could unlock that. Maybe we can add support anti-tanks to my divisions. If we feel that is necessary. Yeah, keep giving me support equipment, but stop sending me these non-aggression pacts. It's not gonna happen. So, Russia is on 89%. Well, unfortunately, we are out of time. So, we cannot watch Russia die today. But, hopefully, when this is all over, I will be able to take a whole bunch of this territory over here. And, hopefully, move, like, also take territory, like, over here. Because I want the steel and the chromium. Well, the chromium, not so much. The steel, definitely. Like... I know there is a lot of steel in Russia. It's just a question of can I grab it before the Japanese do. My contribution should be quite high. 22%. Alright, and Germany is at 30. Well, yeah. But they're going to take the Western stuff. Stuff I don't really care about. But, 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 but. Anyway. I will see you guys in the next episode. But, until then. See ya, and thanks for watching.